Hi guys, welcome to another video. After last week's shark video, there was a comment asking about eels while catching crayfish. How to deal with eels in caves with crayfish. I've been diving many years and catching a lot of crayfish over the years. I've also had many experiences with these eels and uh, they can be quite painful. Many years ago, one of the older crayfishermen divers told me, if an eel bites you, do not pull your hand out. At the time, I thought that's crazy. The moment you feel pain, your natural instinct is to pull your hand out. So I kept that in the back of the mind. And uh, quite often, you can't actually see what's going on in the cave. It's quite dark. You put your hand in, you feel movement, you grab the crayfish, but every now and then you stick your hand in and you get bit. So I'd had one or two experiences where my fingers were quite badly lacerated. That's quite easy to understand if an eel bites, their teeth face backwards. Your natural instinct is to pull. The eel's instinct is to bite and let go. Just to warn you, he doesn't want your hand in there and he gets, shows you a bit of aggression. So the trick is to put your hand in. If you feel pain, don't pull. You'll immediately let go and you can retrieve your hand. The advantage of that is you don't have your, for one, your glove doesn't get torn up. Neither does your fingers. Instead of having long cuts, which can end up in hospital situations where you need to have them stitched, you'll now only have a few punctures and you can actually continue your dive. Um, it is quite difficult to keep your hand there. I didn't think I'd be able to do it, but uh, it does work, believe me. You just gotta have the presence of mind. If you feel pain, keep your hand still. It's a fraction of a second, he'll let go. And you end up with a few punctures, yes, but it's a damn sight better than having nails ripped up uh, pads of your finger torn up. It can be obviously very painful as well as a visit to the doctor to get it sorted out. I hope you guys enjoyed that tip. Stand by for the next.